Oh, those are very uncool sounds to start an episode with. Greetings from the north, everybody. I am I Cabagon. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Half Life Scared. In the next, in the last episode, we were scared, and in this episode, we're going to be even more scared. All right, I don't even remember what I just said, but my dad came down with this giant, big ass cake. I will take a picture of it and I will put it up here. It was huge fucking cake, but that's four videos in a row that I've been interrupted. Oh man, during this recording session. God, every single member of my family has interrupted a video today. My little brother uh, interrupted uh, episode 13 of Pokemon Emerald, so that probably dates this a little bit. My youngest brother interrupted the first episode of this recording session of Half-Life. My mom interrupted the last episode, and now my dad interrupts the very beginning of this one. So nobody can say they didn't know I was recording now. All right, so let's go in here and see what scary, scary things are. Wait, oh, apparently nothing. Well, that was underwhelming. Oh, jeez! <laughs> Crap. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Eat a dick. Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. Why are you not dying? That was a very uncool sound. Die, die, die. All right. I apologize, Mr. Freeman, but I couldn't risk opening that door until I was sure you'd scoured the area. This is the last entrance to the Lambda Complex. Every other has been sealed off to contain the invasion. When we realized that you might actually make it here, we drew straws to see who should stay behind to let you through. Obviously, I drew the short one. My colleagues are waiting at the tip of the Lambda Reactor. Waiting for you, I mean. The reactor is shut down right now, but you can activate it on your way up. You'll have to flood the core anyway to get into the teleportation labs. You're not authorized to know about those. But I can see you already know a great deal more than any one man is supposed to. This is why science is absolutely terrifying. Go ahead and save, because... Okay, first of all, I feel really bad for this guy, because... He... D like... If, like that would that would totally be me. That'd be my luck. Just drawing the short straw and having to go wait for someone. All right, but we did get some of this ammo, which is good. Second of all, the author word use of the word authorized is scary. Cause like, who decides what you're allowed to know? Now that is a whole like other thing, but oh, the fact that we're not supposed to know any of this is just scary. It science is absolutely terrifying. Access denied. Well, how? Are you kidding me? Now my cats are interrupting me. How about you open this, friend? Oh, sweet lord! We're gonna get a full charge of both. Oh, sweet Jesus! All right. I'm not sure how much I want to be playing around with the fire. My cat is seriously interrupting a recording right now. This is, this is ridiculous. Alright, so is this, okay. Okay, we're definitely towards the end of the game now. It's been a long time coming. Oh, God. Remember what he said his colleagues were waiting? I think that might not be correct. Oh, son of a bitch. Where'd it go? Where did it go? Ooh! Oh, I'm done. Oh, 
Jesus. Crap. Just wasted a bolt. I should really reset that because I should not have wasted this many. Oh, you're just like, hey, bud. Oh, man. He's just like, oh, hey, what's up? Get your gun out. Oh, mother. Yeah. Ah, God. Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, ah. Oh, it's so poorly played. Yeah. All right, time to reload and run. All right. This is clearly the core that I have to flood. I'm sorry, I couldn't save you. I will take your ammo, and I will never forget you. Alright, it's possible we're going to run out of shotgun ammo for the first time in, like, a long time. Alright. So I have to flood this. Uh, oh, son of a gun. Whatever it is, I'm running away from it. I should have run and grabbed more breath. There's gonna be, oh god, there's gonna be one of those evil things here. I guarantee it. Oh god, I'm really scared. Let's get the crossbow out. And oh well, what? All right, let's save again. Where is it? No access. Flow from coolant system. Let's open that. And flow from coolant system too. I don't understand. They both didn't work. Do I have to... What the hell? Oh wait. Is the water rising? I, I can't... I cannot tell. It does not appear to be rising. God, do I just have to do this really quick? Because I can do that. Apparently I can't. Let's just... Is the water rising is what I want to know. Alright. I think it's possible that I might have gone the wrong way. Oh, and it's also possible that I just missed the spot for air, so... And it's also possible that there's some kind of alien around that did spawn when I was down there. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, God diggity damn it. All right. Let's go the other way. Too bad we don't have our security friend. Oh, man. Series of poor decisions by Brian. You'll need to activate both pumps to flood the reactor, and then that access pipe down there will take you to the core. Time is short. And supplies are great. Holy crap. How much stuff did we just get? No shotgun shells. A lot of those. 
to get, fill this back up to 90. Oh man, oh man. Oh, oh, 95. And that is full. Alright, and we got a lot of that. Which means there's a huge fight coming on. So we will stick with this gun. Uh, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. So in the next episode of Let's Play Half-Life Blind, we will be flooding the uh, the pumps and heading back to the core. So with that, guys, I've been iCabagon. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and a comment as well. Subscribe for more videos like this one if you have not done so already. Don't forget to check out my Twitch channel and Twitter page. Links are both in the description below. I will see you all next time for some more Let's Play Half-Life Blind.